Okay, we talked about it earlier, you know, the flags whipping in the wind, looking majestic mm -hmm. at half-staff. Governor Pawlenty made the order in honor of Patriot Day, calling the U.S. the greatest nation on earth. And tonight, a musical tribute for the victims of 9-11. Fox 9's Rob Olson joining us live now at Lake Harriet. And I'm guessing we can hear you this time, Rob. Yeah, we there can. You, you know, a, a bad microphone cable may make you mad on other nights. But I tell you what, in tonight, in the context of the event that we're covering, it really kind of puts it in perspective. We'll take a bad microphone cable any night. It is no big deal compared to, of course, what we're talking about, 9-11. Cleaning up here at Lake Harriet, one of two events we covered tonight, two sides of the 9-11 coin. In one instance, a group who says we should never forget what happened, and another group who says we should never forget to ask questions about what happened. But to those many who turned out for this memorial tonight, of course, it is uh, much, much more than just a one night and we're done. A lot of those people, by the way, that uh, showed up to watch that film tonight, many of them say that, uh, you know, there, there are a lot of people who get into conspiracy theories. There are many who say, though, that we should just keep asking questions and finding out really if there are people who still to this day should be held accountable for what happened six years ago. Live at Lake Harriet, Robelson, Fox 9.